Hi, welcome to Kauzurvice channel. In this series of videos, we are going to see regression analysis. First, let us see the basic concepts and formulas. In the upcoming videos, we are going to see list of numerical problem on regression analysis. You can find the links in the description box. Also, you can find the links for various topics on various subjects over there. If you are new to my channel, please do subscribe and hit the bell icon to get the further notification of my new uploads. Now, let's get into the video. See, before we see the numerical problem, let us try to understand the basic concept about regression. First, let us see the meaning of regression. The meaning of regression is, regression is the study of the relationship between the variables. That is, uh, it shows a relationship between the average value of two variables. Okay, so it is very helpful in estimating and predicting the average value of one variable for a given value of other variable. Okay, so here we have regression line. What is regression line? Which shows the average value of one variable that is x for a given value of other variable y. Okay, so with the help of given one variable, we are going to find out the other variable. Okay, with the help of an equation that is regression equation. Regression equation means the best average value of one variable which is associated with the given value of the other variable may also be estimated or predicted by means of an equation. Okay, so here the regression analysis can be done with the help of regression equation. We are going to find out the best average of one variable which is related with the other variable. Okay, so we are going to estimate or predict with the help of a regression equation. Now let us see what are the two different types of variables. Types of variables. Here we have two different types of variables in regression analysis. The first one is independent variable and the second one dependent variable. So what is independent variable? Here the variable which influences the value or is used for prediction is called independent variable. For example, we are going to find out the value of x based on y. Okay, so according to this statement, y is used for prediction. So that the y is called independent variable. The variable which is used for prediction is called independent variable. The other one is dependent variable. Dependent variable means the variable whose value is influenced or is to be predicted is called dependent variable. For example, see if you are going to find out value of x based on the given value of y that is x on y. So, which value you are going to find out? We are going to find out x based on what? Based on the given value of y. Okay. So, here the given value is independent variable. Okay. Okay. Why is independent variable? The reason is this is used for prediction. So, this variable is independent variable and this one is dependent variable. The reason is we are going to predict x based on y. Okay. So, this one is dependent variable and y is independent variable. Okay. Now, let us see different types of regressions. Types of regressions. So, regressions are classified into four different types. The first one is simple regression. Second one multiple regression. Third one linear regression. And the last one non-linear regression. So, what is simple regression? Simple regression means it is a study of only two variables at a time. Okay. So, we are going to find out the relationship between two different variables at a time. It is called simple regression. The second one is multiple regression. So, multiple regression means studying more than two variables at a time. The next one linear regression. Linear regression means if the regression curve is a straight line, then it is called linear regression. Okay. The last one, non-linear regression. If the curve or regression is not a straight line, then it is called non-linear regression. So, these are the four different types of regressions. Now, let us see the formula for lines of regression. Okay. See, what is the meaning of line of regression? Already I have explained, you know, the meaning of line of regression is... Uh, 
it is a line okay which gives the best estimate of one variable that is x for any given value of other variable that is y okay here we have two different equations the first one is line of regression of x on y we are going to find out x based on y the other formula is line of regression of y on x we are going to find out the value of y based on the given value of x these are the two different possibilities of lines of regression the first one is x on y the second one y on x okay this is the formula the formula is x minus x bar is equal to r into standard deviation x divided by standard deviation y into y minus y bar this is the equation to find out x okay x on y y value will be given based on the given value we are going to find out the other value that is x on y the second one is y on x same thing but here we are going to find out y so the formula is y minus y bar is equal to r into standard deviation y divided by standard deviation x into x minus x bar okay so here we have x bar and y bar no so x bar y bar means uh, means of x and y series okay we are going to find out the means 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 average average of x series and average of y series okay x bar and y bar standard deviation x and standard deviation y that is a uh, standard deviation of x series and standard deviation of y series okay r denotes correlation coefficient between x and y okay so these are the abbreviation for the formula now let us see the simple formula for this part that is r into standard deviation x and standard deviation y so we have a separate formula for b of xy and b of yx b of xy means r into standard deviation x divided by standard deviation y the formula is n into sigma xy minus sigma x into sigma y divided by n into sigma y square minus sigma y whole square so this is the formula for b of xy b of xy means r into standard deviation x divided by standard deviation y okay so based on that we have another formula for y on x that is uh, b of yx the formula is numerator same thing denominator only we have difference because uh, here we are going to find out y based on x the given value is x here we are going to find out x based on y the given value is y okay the formula is n into sigma xy minus sigma x into sigma y divided by n into sigma x square minus sigma x whole square so n means number of series okay so this is the formula for b of yx that is a uh, r into standard deviation y divided by standard deviation x okay and this is the formula for b of xy that is r into standard deviation x divided by standard deviation y now see the formula for lines of regression see the line of regression of x on y the formula is x minus x bar is equal to r into standard deviation x divided by standard deviation y instead of this we can do b of xy okay into y minus y bar in the same way line of regression of y on x the formula is y minus y bar is equal to r into standard deviation y divided by standard deviation x instead of this we can put b of yx into x minus x bar okay based on these formulas we are going to see the numerical problems in the upcoming series you can find the links in the description box hope you like this video please hit the like comment subscribe and share with your friends thank you